do got to be a little careful. Because it's going to be... Whoa! It's just my first slip of the day, and it wasn't even that bad. Whoa! Whoa. This is Otter Falls right here. Otter Falls. These falls kind of kind of resemble a little family of otters to me. But now it's actually official. So this definitely isn't the most the most beautiful day to be doing this sort of thing. Um, but I kind of I have a feeling that the rain is just gonna gonna add to the atmosphere. I knew I had to experience something magical for this day. And uh, selfishly, I really just want to I want to I want to commemorate this day. I want to I want to be able to save it and be able to look back and and know that this is what I did, that I got to experience magic on, on the Tuesday. I don't think this is going to be the Otter Falls. I'm, I'm, I'm expecting a little bit bigger anyways, but look at this view up here. Wet wood, moisture in the air, moss-covered rocks, browns and greens and dark grays and all that. It's always just been my favorite, my favorite thing. Look at this. And look how gorgeous this is. Starting to have that magical feeling. There you go. I do gotta be a little careful. Because it's gonna be. Whoa! Alright. It's okay. It's just my first slip of the day. It's just my first slip of the day, and it wasn't even that bad. This, uh, this lovely tree right here really broke my fall. And the main thing that's so special about today is just being surrounded by these, by these wet... I don't know, it feels like I'm becoming one with, with Otter Falls, with all, this, with all of this moisture in the air. <laughs> Whoa! You keep, you, keep missing my, you keep missing my falls, but <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm sitting on the ground. And it looks like someone else probably fell here as well because whoever it is, I found your glove. Okay. Let's make that the second and last, the second and last fall here at, at Otter Falls. I just realized that it has uh, the word, the word, word falls built right into the name. The first thought that comes to my head is I want this to be my backyard, but, you know, it, it's, it sort of is. I'm here right now, aren't I? Nothing's stopping me from, from coming back either. Ugh. I think we, I think we've got to fall up ahead, folks. Look at this. It's our first good sighting of it. And if I had to take a guess, I would say that that right there is Otter Falls. So down here is obviously where we can get the most intimate, the most up close with, with the Otter Falls here. So my voice is gonna be competing a little bit with the uh, with the water, but another another beautiful thing is the sun decided to just start peeking out for a moment. I'm have to slip on this rock. All right, come on, Ralph. Let's go. Ralph, let's go. Let's go. Whoa. Almost just took another dive down these stairs. You see that little like cave in the background over there? I don't think it's really a cave uh, as much as it is just kind of an enclosure covered by some rocks, but it looks really cool. I don't know how close we're going to be able to get down to the bottom here, but a two for my two, 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 two day. And even right here, wow. You see what I'm talking about with all of this detail in here? 
just everywhere you look is just it's so busy but it's but it's all coming together in like one one living piece of art all right let's try and make it actually down actually down to the falls i threw an extra pair of socks in my car in case my uh in case my shoes fail again like in the last video all right at the base of the falls this is otter falls right here otter falls let's do another thumbnail another two There she is, from the bottom. Look at this massive rock. I'm gonna talk really loud. In case you can't hear me over the Otter Falls back here. Let's get up as close as we can. Look what I found over here on the left. It's the baby otter falls. Yeah, this way, Ralph. It's actually not as slippery down here as I thought. I think maybe we can even even crawl under, like behind the waterfalls. I'm gonna try. Fairies? Any fairies in there want to say hello? It's, it's Tuesday. It's the perfect time. It's the perfect time to come out. You don't fall, don't worry. I got it, Jeff. I got it. Come on, bro. You got it. Get up there. Don't fall. Hey, Rafi. I think Rafi's a little nervous being behind that falls here. All right. Literally crawling on the rock. But now it's actually official. I'm literally like. It almost feels. I'm trying to think of the words to say, but looking through the water like that is, uh, it's mesmerizing. It feels really amazing to, to, to be right here, right now. Literally behind Otter Falls. That's where we're heading. Is it mesmerizing you too? Is it mesmerizing you too? This is a new experience for both of us. Don't worry. Past all the danger now. I mean, again, this is what I call enchanted. If you don't call this an enchanted look, I guess we just we, we don't see eye to eye on that. Let's continue crawling upwards. Let's get a little shot of Otter Falls from. The opposite side. There's where we crawled. And here's where we are right now. If you decided to take a nap in here, You'd even have to contend with the skylight up above. Even the sun's starting to come out now. It's starting to sort of light this whole place up. Bring all the colors to life. I'm telling you. When you when you intend to experience magic, you'll you will always experience magic. Especially if you aren't, especially if you can learn to not look for it. That's when you'll find the magic. It's when you just let it, when you let it speak to you when you let it show itself to you the kind of you know answer nobody wants to hear is that it's already all around you you just have to you have to open your eyes and 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 
be willing to see it. But now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head back, and head back the same way we came. And um, who knows, there's more, to, there's more to search here. We'll go down the river a little bit and see what else we can find on this uh, trail here at Otter Falls. We're back down at the bottom. We're back across from uh, Otter Falls there. I think what we're going to do is just, uh, you know, explore this, explore this majestic river that comes off of the falls here. Walk down it, try and make our way along the rocks or something, and uh, I don't know how this, how this Tuesday could get any more magical, but never say never, right? Bye, Otter Falls. You think I, you think I got my wish? You think I found an enchanted place? See what I'm talking about? I can even see some ice. I don't know if you can see it in the camera. Right, right in there somewhere, there's ice. I'm trying to find the path, it's like a video game. Right down here, there's a trick. It's very slippery. We're going for it. See where I'm walking? So far the shoes are holding up. They've made it. Look right over here. First of all, look at all these moss covered, uh, moss covered roots. And then back right there, you see it? You see it? Yeah. Am I pointing at it? Yeah. Right there. It's like a big old a block of ice. Look at this. I, uh, that thing is a solid, that is a solid chunk of ice. I couldn't move this if I wanted to. I kind of want to lick it, but I don't want to, uh, I don't want my tongue to get stuck on it like a, a Christmas movie. Little bonus fact. Ralphie over here, I named him after Ralphie on A Christmas Story, just because I've always loved that movie. Nothing like a good lick of a, of a bear piss popsicle on the side of a mountain. I just thought that was pretty cool, that little ice block hanging in there. I noticed it from across. And look at, like, this is, this is the enchanted, uh, this is what I was talking about. Look at this from a distance now. Wow. Way over there, that's where we came from. In fact, way on top of that hill. You know, I started talking about how much I love moss and, and look where I'm at. I find myself near months later. So absolutely just surrounded by this stuff. Realistically, I have to sort of rein in my, uh, I have to rein in my, my 360s. If I did a 360 every time I thought there was something interesting to see, I'd be, I'd be spinning around till I fell over dizzy in places like this. Look at that racing, racing waterfall. Look at that giant rock. Throw me away, my friend. Woo. This is the Big Boy Mountains. This is the uh, this is the Smoky Mountains in North Carolina that I'm crawling around in. Not on the outskirts. This is this is smack dab in the. Uh, what some may argue is one of the most magical places on earth. Uh oh, I feel the spin coming. I feel a spin. I feel a spin. We also get to test our, uh, our cliff bravery skills today. One more beautiful view before this is all over. It's 
the place we gotta be careful, Ralph. Sometimes leaves and rocks can get a, can get a little slick. But you know, there's a helpful uh, there's a helpful tree giving us a giving us a hand. See, that's that's a little example of the magic that I'm always talking about. So yet another another otter fall. You know what? Otters are very social animals. That's part of the reason that I love them so much. So these falls, there's another one right behind. We'll get a little closer to it in just a second. Uh, these falls kind of kind of resemble a little family of otters to me. Just little playful, little pro playful beings, you know, dancing around all over the uh, all over the rocks, all the way down the stream. Let's go up and get another amazing shot. As if this video isn't full of enough of them. Got another fall right behind me. I hope I'm talking loud enough in front of the water. Uh, you may have clued in on that I, I don't know, I, I like to hear myself talk, I always have. Anyways, what should we deem this one? The lower, the lower otter falls. Okay, so I've officially made my way um, as, as far down the stream as we're gonna go here at Otter Falls in North Carolina. I wanna say North Carolina because this is my home state and I'm so proud of it. When I see things like this, it just makes me, it makes me so proud of um, to, live, to live where I live. So now I'm gonna make my way back up top. I'm not quite sure if there's, if there's more to discover here. We'll get back up to kind of the, the part where we, where we met our first, um, you know, otter fall. And uh, we'll, we'll recoup, we'll, we'll do a little bit more exploring, see if there's anything else to find on these trails. And I'll, I'll see you back up there. This otter falls definitely does have some, some steep cliffs in it. You're on about Rafi. Smell something? Maybe this will be the relaxing portion of the of the trip. The part that kind of rubs your back as you make your way, you know, back to back from where you came from, back through the portal that you entered when you first stepped foot onto whatever trail you're exploring. Oh, some deer! I got scared because. Oh, please let us see magic off in the distance. Can you see them? Come back. Oh, they're looking at me. It's two of them. They're looking at me. Look, they're so curious. Just like I am. I don't want to do anything to you. another one there's another one just looking in the woods at me right up there if you're watching this video I'm sure you've experienced this but if you're ever uh, if you ever get the opportunity to look into the eyes of any wild animal especially a larger one like a deer that you know, actually has a little bit more of a resemblance to our own size when you lock eyes in the woods, you can, you can almost feel the connection. You can almost feel like, um, like there's a cord attached between our two minds and you can, you can speak to each other, just not with, not with words like we're used to. You're speaking to each other with, with feelings. It's not about special days. It's not about anything that you give any meaning to. It means nothing. Everything only means what it means to you, to you. Whew, path is awfully mucky. And that might sound pessimistic, but the beauty of it is that everything, everything can mean anything to you. So make everything mean something good. Why not? I think we're actually about done with Otter Falls. I see the sign uh, to the parking lot right back up top there. 
So this trail will probably bring us, yeah, this trail is probably gonna bring us right back up top. The actual name of where this place is located is called Seven Devils. And just the, uh, the road coming up here kind of winds really steep around the, the Seven Devils Mountain. It's really cool. It's a really cool experience just, just driving up here. Anyways, we're back at the top. Can you believe that Otter Falls was literally just here waiting for me today? I'll see you on my next adventure, wherever it is. I'm excited. I'm ex as excited to find out as you are.